whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight. This is the fifth year from the time we dedicated the Veterans Memorial back in uh, May of 2011. We have had an outstanding turnout ever since we started this Memorial Day service. Uh, it's amazing. The first year we felt the turnout would be good because of dedicating the monument. But our turnout has been exceptional every year since then. I, I think for a small community to have as many outside people come to Star City, I think it speaks a lot for the patriotism that we still have in 2016. But for me as a veteran, I don't want people to forget. We can forget too easily, but people are sacrificing last night, and there'll be people sacrificing today, sons and daughters. We want to remember those who did sacrifice and pray for the ones who are there in the war zones today. I don't want them to forget. I just think it's something. It's a day to honor Americans' heroes. We have a lot of people, as I said, this family, friends, neighbors, loved ones who laid down their lives for this country and for us so that we have the freedom that we have today. Take time to reflect. That picnic with your family, paid for in full by our patriots. Your vacation at the beach, made possible by the sacrifice of military heroes. A peaceful ride in the country, opportunity provided by our guardians of freedom. The pride, protest, and pageantry of holiday parades, won for us by those who lie silent in the ground. Remember them, honor them, and never forget them. God bless America, my home sweet.